Ladies and gentlemen, a good nerve of Shabbos, everybody. Let's try to learn a little bit more from the Kedushas Levi. It's always good to learn Torah. Uba Pusik, and in the verse, Vayar, Vayaratz, Lekrasam. So, Abraham saw them and he ran to greet them, which is weird because they were standing on top of him and then he had to go run to greet them. Which again, points to this idea that there's something more supernatural going on here. Obviously, we know from our tradition that these were angels, but the angels themselves were the archetypes, we could say, of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Perhaps also we could say maybe that's why there was only two angels that visited Lot. We could discuss that as well, although there's all different types of interpretations. Rashi brings different things that the Malach Rafal came to, uh, the angel Raphael came to heal Abraham, and once he was done with that, uh, he was done. Anyway, Commenting now on Genesis 18:2, that oh, which is the same verse, it's just a continuation of the verse that we had in our previous video. Uh, We're talking about Abraham. He was in pain from the circumcision. There is this idea that you're supposed to have mercy on someone who is sick. Avraham is chazik b'chan larutz lekrasam. But Abraham strengthened himself here to run to greet them. Asa kan midas gura. So therefore, here he conducted himself in accordance with the attribute of gevura. Which we discussed before, strength and self-control. And that's how he's worthy to the soul of Isaac. So again, we we have to see Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob as Jungian archetypes in a certain sense. More than just these actual people, which they also were, but these archetypes that go beyond physicality and so because Abraham went against his nature but used his nature to go against nature pretty much for this reason he was worthy to have a son Isaac who was by his nature someone who held back So once again, like we said previously, we have here the attributes of Abraham and Isaac together. Because Isaac is this attribute of Ura, of self-control, of strength. So therefore we find that here you have both the attributes of Abraham and Isaac. And everywhere you have Abraham and Isaac together, you have to have Jacob. We're talking about the archetypes, uh, the attributes here. So once again, we are confirming that which we quoted from the Zohar in the previous Gemara Torah, and you can watch that as well, that he saw three men, and who were they according to the Zohar? They were Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Thank you for watching. God bless. Please like, share, and subscribe, comment. Have a good Shabbos. And press that bell button if you didn't yet to get notified when we put up more videos. Thank you.